This is a Sessions video tutorial, creating realistic perspective. We'll add a painting to the angled wall in this image, using some tricks to give it realistic perspective. We'll use this painting, but for now let's hide the layer and create a new layer for our guidelines. Use the Line tool to extend the angled ceiling and floor lines until they converge at a point. This is called the vanishing point, and all horizontal lines on this wall should aim for it to achieve realistic perspective. Now select the painting layer and go to Edit, Transform, Distort. Push and pull the corner handles, distorting the painting so that its top and bottom edges aim for the vanishing point. Then, just using your eye, see if you've come close. My top line aims much too low, and my bottom line is a little bit high. As you work, make sure you leave the sides vertical, totally parallel to the vertical wall line. Now make some changes to the corners based on your observations. I'm bumping the top one up a bit, hopefully getting it a lot closer. I'll make a few more small adjustments. And then when I think I've got it, I'm going to press Enter. Then use your line tool to check your work. Here you can see that my top line is still off, but my bottom line is pretty close. I'll get rid of the lines and try again, again going to Edit, Transform, Distort. This time my changes are more minor, and I think I'm getting much closer. Now that I've checked by eye and I think I'm close, I'll press enter again and use the line tool one more time to check my work. I'm still a little off here, so I'll go make some final adjustments. This technique takes some trial and error, but it's still one of the easiest ways to add realistic perspective to your Photoshop work. I can get rid of my vanishing point layer and I'm all done.